What is going on world? Welcome back once again. My name is Zach Novak and this is Zach Novak Plays Games. In today's video, we've got Zor's location and inventory. This video should have gone up, well, almost a day and a half ago. I do apologize, but anyway, last Zor's video for the year for Destiny 1. Hopefully you guys are seriously hyped for Destiny 2. Enjoy the video, roll the intros, and let's get into it. Alrighty, so Zor's stuff. Getting straight into it, I'm gonna be really quick because this week I'm in a bit of a hurry, man, on the cloud. Actually, gonna go through and do the nightfall with some random guy called Squeakle or something like that. Pretty freaking awesome, but anyway, starting things off, we've got Plan C. If you guys haven't got Plan C, it's 23 strange coins, pretty, pretty beastly, and it's actually, actually deals arc burn fates, which is pretty fucking cool because this week is arc. Anyway, we've got Hip Fire, pretty freaking decent. We've got Accelerator Course, we've got Hammer Forge, we've also got Perfect Balance, and it's main perk Plan C. Charging equip times are very short, immediately after weapon swap. Pretty freaking decent. If you haven't got it, go ahead and pick it up because Zor's gone. Anyway, getting next up, we've got the Purify Rebs for the Warlock. Intellect and Discipline roll of uh, 56 and 52, max again at 81 and 77. The main perk on this is called Burn Brighter. Activating Radiance from this disorientates nearby enemies. Pretty freaking cool. Secondary perks are Special Ammo, Heavy Ammo, as well as Arc Burn Defense and Soul Armor. Pretty freaking decent if you got it. It's 13 strange coins. Pick it up. Next up, we've got the Shinobi's Vouts for the Hunter. It's a pure discipline roll of 67, max again at 84. 13 strange coins. Main perk on this is called New Tricks. Improved Skip Grenade, you gain an additional Skip Grenade charge. If you haven't actually seen the overview or review on this, go ahead and click that thing in the top right corner and it'll actually take you to the video. I did one a while ago and it's pretty freaking decent. Anyway, secondary perks are Fastball as well as Impact Induction. We got Pulse Rifle Loader and Heavy Loader. Pretty freaking cool. Or Rocket Launch if you want. Anyway, next up, we've got the Ring Wings for the Titan. It is Discipline and Strength of 40 and 40 maxing out of 57 and 57. Main perk on this is actually called Seeds of Ruin. Heavy ammo drops more often and gains more ammo in each drop. Secondary perks are Rain Blows as well as Momentum Transfer. We've got Pulse Rifle Loader as well as Rocket Launch Loader. Pretty freaking decent. 13 Strange Coins for all three of these. Go ahead and pick them up if you haven't got it because Zor's going away. Well, he hasn't actually going away, but this is the last week I'm covering him. And finally, next up, we've actually got the Legacy Engram. 31 Strange Coins for a Legacy Special Engram. And you get it equipped into a U1 special with U1 rolls, U1 stats, and all that U1 goodness. And you pick it up, you have a collector, I want to get something from year 2, year 3, session year 4, that was available in Chaos King 1. Next up, we've got Weapon Bundles. We've got the Invective and Storm's Reproach, as well as Trespasser and Fall. And if you want to see both of these, I'll actually go ahead and show you this quickly. It is 30 Strange Coins and 25 Silver Dust. They look pretty freaking decent if you want to actually have a look at them. We've got the Invective right here. Invective's Storm's Reproach, as you can see, it looks like they've been shot by lightning or dipped in lava. Pretty freaking decent. I love it. And go ahead and pick it up. If you haven't got it, it is pretty freaking decent as a weapon. And we also have the Trespasser with Fallen Assassin. Looks pretty freaking decent, but yeah. Anyway, moving on. Back to the rest. And for Zor's Curious, as you guys can see, it is actually a blue screen or a black screen, but I'll have an actual picture over the actual thing because Destiny decided it wanted to screw around. Anyway, we've got Curious, we got the Emerald Coil Drive and Plasma Drive, I'm thinking they are 23 strange coins used to upgrade your Respirators into Legendary Respirators, if you like that kind of thing. We've also got 3 Heavy Emerald Synthesis, 3 Heavy Emerald Synthesis, 1 Strange Coin, we've also got 10 Heavy Emerald Synthesis, 4, 3 Strange Coins. Go ahead and pick up the 10 because you always got the extra one. We've also got the next up, the Beast that are actually going away because Destiny 2 is now coming. We've got the Strange Coins. Go ahead and pick up any of these if you want. 5 3 coins for 7 Strange Coins. Next up, We've got glass needles. There's three glass needles, three strange coins, three months of that, and one exotic shard. If you're low on exotic shards, Zor sells one exotic shard for seven strange coins. If you're low on strange coins or exotic shards, then go ahead and click that actual video. That'll, but at the end of this video, they'll show you how to get unlimited exotic shards. If you guys want to see it, there's pretty awesome comments in the comment section. And finally, we have a motor light. One motor light for two strange coins. That is Zor's location and the inventory for the weekend. This has been Zach Novak. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this video. This is the last Zor video of the year, and I'm glad that it is a fucking up grand. Until next time, this is Zach Novak. Do all that good stuff for me. Cheering like Kieran. If he was and sure, but until next time, this is Zach Novak signing off. Peace out. As we sit and watch the hangar, the final days of Destiny 1, the game that started it so many years ago. For us, it was more than just a hobby, it became a way of life. A way we made friends, a way to connect, to explore and experience things we never thought possible. In a game, in a world, where things just aren't what they seem, where humans and guardians and aliens all live together in some form of coexistence. It may not be friendship, and it may not be dedication, but they are trustworthy. Not to say they're trustworthy to the fact of we know they won't hurt us. It's trustworthy to say that in the future 
we're gonna kick their fucking ass. So as to the future of Destiny 2, and as to you guys watching this video, I have to say thank you for this time, thank you for enjoying my content, and towards the future, let's hit it. Destiny 2, here we come. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, click that like button down below. Do all that good stuff, and I'll be cheering like Kieran if he was at Sheeran. It's getting me a little bit teary actually having a look at this, because... Thank you, phone. It's Sunday. It's not too long till Destiny 2. And holy jeez, the hype is real. Until the next video, this is Zach Novak. Signing off. Peace out.